Hi there, it's AJ from KajabiExperts.com. No, Coke doesn't sponsor me. I just was so thirsty. So in this video today, we're gonna see something that has been recently asked in Kajabi. And the question is how we can make our images in the posts and in general in the whole Kajabi responsive so that they adapt to the different sizes of the platforms. This is really easy, but it will need a bit of tweaking code. I decided and I said, I'm gonna create a video. So here I am creating this video just for you. Let's go now and let's see how we should do this, how we can make the images responsive for the different devices inside Kajabi. I'm here inside Kajabi and I have a sales page that I just created that doesn't have anything at all. So I'm gonna add an image that has a bigger size. So you see how we're gonna adapt it to the different device and how we're gonna make it responsive. The image I'm gonna add is uh, this one here. And I'm just gonna upload it. I'm gonna drag it here. Here we have the image. I'm gonna save and you will see how this image goes outside of the store page. So you see that it goes outside of the store page. Here we have two options. We can uh, either resize the image and make it visually uh, appealing in, in this page, but the problem will be with mobile and tablets, or we can do the following option. And this was what I was mentioning before that I was gonna create a video about how to do that. It's something really easy. We're gonna be editing the code, but it's something really, really easy to do. So don't be scared. We're gonna go to our, um, this This works for sales page, this works for um, static pages, post pages and everything as soon as they are using the Twitter bootstrap theme. Uh, sorry, not theme, Twitter bootstrap and um, framework, CSS framework. Uh, probably this sounds to you like Chinese, so I would tell you that nowadays all of the pages, well not all, but most of the pages created for Kajabi have that. So my suggestion is just try it, if it works then fine, if it doesn't then sorry, you have to go for another option. There are there other ways to do it, but they are a little bit more complex. What we're gonna do is we're gonna click as always to the source code. And here we see our image. If you have more stuff here, search for your image. It's just this image tag, okay? Now we're going to search for class. We see EMG, so image, SRC, and we see the URL here, and we see alt, and nothing else. Here the image is closed. So there is no class. If, if it would be a class, then we, we would use it. But as there is no class, we're gonna add it. So for example, here be, be after the EIMG, we're gonna write class with double S equals and the uh, double quotes. So class equals and the quotes. And inside this, we're gonna write IMG dash responsive img dash responsive and now we're just gonna hit okay that's it actually that's it we're gonna save we are going to refresh here and you see that now the image is adapted i'm gonna show you how it looks in mobile so uh, probably you don't know that or, or yes but there is a responsive mode in chrome where you can just see how your site works in mobile if you do this always refresh so after enable this and changing the here you can change the device that you want just refresh the page and you see now that it appears right in mobile you'll see the difference i'm gonna just undo what i did so you also see again what i did so i'm gonna just remove the class img responsive delete that okay save now i'm gonna refresh and you're gonna see the difference so just refreshing and you see that the image is completely broken on mobile. Uh, just again, source code here, class equals EMG responsive. 
space ok save and we're going to refresh here and i'm going to show you how it looks like on a tablet so i'm going to select here the ipad and you see it looks amazing so you see a very 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 easy uh, tip that will make your images uh, be responsive on the different devices and as always if you like the video hit the thumbs up button in youtube subscribe to get more videos to get more tips about kajabi about curse building and more stuff and if you have any questions post a comment below or contact me directly. I also accept suggestions for videos like this one here where someone was asking in the Facebook group. So if you have any suggestion, just post it in a comment or send me a message or whatever and I will try to do my best to create a video. Thank you.